Every once in a while comes a personality who emerges as a titan in this cutthroat corporate world and achieves so much, which makes him stand apart from the rest. The legendary leader of Starbucks coffee, Howard Schultz, is one such personality. A billionaire three times over. Yes, when Schultz talks, even Wall Street and the White House listens. But with the news of Schultz stepping down as a CEO for the second time to give way for the chief operating officer Kevin Johnson to take over after the disaster of stock tumblings in the last few years, it's time to look at his life's extraordinary journey which made him a close ally of not only the previous President Obama, but also the nominated candidate for 2020 election, Hillary Clinton, who could very well be the next President of the United States. Coming from the humble beginnings of Brooklyn, New York, Howard Schultz's father, Fed, never made more than $20,000 a year and was never able to achieve his dream of buying a home due to the three children that he had to feed. When his father broke his ankle at work in 1961, their family had no income. This was when Schultz decided that if he ever reached a position where he could make a difference, he wouldn't leave people behind. He went on to become the first college graduate of his family after graduating from Northern Michigan University. Hence which, he worked in sales and marketing at Xerox for three years. After serving as a vice president and general manager of Hammerplast USA, Schultz moved to Seattle to join Starbucks in 1982 as a director of operations and marketing. For a brief period in 1983, Schultz left Starbucks to start his own company, Il Giornale Coffee Houses, but returned to buy the Starbucks in 1987 with the help of a few loyal investors. At the time when he first took over as the CEO, Starbucks had about 17 store locations, which have now risen to more than 25,000 Starbucks locations across 75 countries, giving employment to more than 300,000 people at his now-bought coffee company. All through his journey, Schultz never forgot about his ground roots, which is why he offered health insurance to eligible full and part-time workers, gave his employees a portion of stock in the company, Beanstalks, committed $30 to help veterans transition into the civilian workforce through his personal foundation, Schultz Family Foundation, committed to hiring 10,000 veterans and military spouses in 2013. He has already hired more than 8,000 so far. Largely seen as the smarts behind the much-vaunted success of Starbucks, Schultz once told CNBC, This is a team sport. It has always been a team sport. I've gotten more credit than I deserve. The company has a large base of fantastic leaders. In addition to his wealth of awards earned over the years, not many know that Schultz is also the best-selling author of two well-known books that put a spotlight on his fierce determination and unwavering persistence that forms the foundation of his outstanding journey. We hope that you liked this video. For more videos like this, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and we will see you next Wednesday.